What's going on guys, it's your boy Gunner two times bringing you another video. It's a late one, my power was off all day today. So it's been kind of a rough one. You know, we got a power back on so everything is straight. Now this is all an opinionated video about Fortnite. Do not kill me in the comments, even if I get any comments, which I probably will if I do this right. Now with Fortnite being the top game in the whole gaming community, is it really worth saying that this is the best game on console? Now, let's not forget that Battle Royale for Fortnite is free. Then there was a regular version of the game. You know, it was a PvE type of game where you build forts and buildings and you try to defend yourself against zombies. Now, since Battle Royale came into the effect for Fortnite back in 2017, it was a complete beast now for one of the reasons for the game to actually do this good in the last couple months i'm gonna have to say it it's, it's free for everybody you know everybody doesn't have to spend any money unless you buy some of the costumes in the game that's in game uh cosmetics and stuff but the game is free so anybody can get their hands on it see me and me and my nephews we play fortnite together sometime when they come over we'll have a setup where i have mine and then the xbox will be on the other side of the room and we'll play and it's really triggered the kids to really play this game and take it serious and one of the reasons for that is because it's free now it's not a 60 plus game it's not 30 dollars like PUBG, and you don't have to spend any money if you don't want to so it being free is definitely a huge contributor for the huge amounts of players playing this game on a daily basis now with 3.2 million players consistently playing this game day in and day out that's a lot of people now i'm gonna challenge it by saying if this if this wasn't free would this be the same way i mean what if it was like 40 dollars for the for the DLC of the uh, Battle Royale, or what if it wasn't included in the game and you had to buy it separately and it was $60? Like stuff like that. But I'm not gonna cut it short because it's Fortnite. No, I'm not gonna cut it short because it's a free to play. I'm gonna cut it short because it's, it's getting a lot of hype because it's free. You know, a lot of people, anything that's free, everything that's free is good. You know what I'm saying? You get your hands on it, and it's one of the most trending video games probably of all time. I see it, I see it on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, Google's on Google Trends. You know, Fortnite is an amazing game, and not a lot of people can actually play this game because it does take skill. Now, the building aspect of the game is a great idea to defend yourself against oncoming engagements within the game. And I love the aspect of seeing other streamers, Ninja included, and a lot of other people build an engagement to defend themselves. Now, I am not bashing this game because it's Fortnite and it has a lot of hype. I'm not bashing it at all because I look at it for both sides of it being free and what if you actually had to pay for this. I'm glad we actually can, can have a game in the community that's free and it's worth playing. Usually when you get free stuff in the gaming, uh, the gaming stores, it's always bad. Like it's never really fulfilling. And this one, this is probably one of the best free games we could possibly say we've ever had because it gives, it gives weekly updates, I think. I don't know, I don't know how the updates go, but it's constantly updated, new, new gear, new outfits you know what i'm saying like stuff like that to keep the game fresh and events that's going on like the the uh chinese new year and how they did the christmas you know stuff like that keeps the game fresh and i'm glad to actually see a game like this keep it going now will the game keep this hype throughout the year yes it will i don't see this game actually going anywhere in the near future it's going to keep growing and growing and it should not lose any of its populations unless a new competitor comes along with new games coming out in the fall of 2018 so but other than that man it's a free game it's a beautiful game to play with friends and family and it's definitely one game that you actually have to learn and you cannot just get on here and do good you got to put hours into it which is dope as hell so i wish those guys at epic games to keep it going keep it up 
I play it from time to time. This is not my gameplay. I actually searched online for a uh, free to use gameplay with no copyright and I actually seen this guy so I'll leave it in the description if you want to do that for your next video. His uh, name of his YouTube is No Copyright Games and he does a lot of Fortnite, you know what I'm saying? So I'll leave that in the description if you want to go check him out. So, because I I'm bad, I'm bad at Fortnite, I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't gonna sit here and say I'm the greatest of all time with 10,000 plus kills and number one rank in the world. I'm terrible at Fortnite, but I still love to play with friends because it's funny and it's definitely enjoyable to have something free for the game, for the gamers out there, man. There's a lot of great people that play this game day in and day out. But other than that, this is a short video of my analysis of Fortnite. And keep it up, Epic Games. This is your boy Gunner, two times bringing you another video. Please like, subscribe, and comment ideas below. And I am out. Peace.